Now it's uh, no longer up air, up air, up air, up B. It's just up air and cry. Up air and cry because you can't do it anymore. Yeah, true combo. Yeah. Up air to cry. Up air to cry chain. And then it, 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 can you combo up air out of cry? Um, If the opponent DI is very poorly. Okay. And then they cry. And then they cry, yes. Okay, um, so Rock and Ryan with his or DDD. I, or I my think name I've is played his DDD a couple times. I haven't recently. Yeah. Um, but we're going to see this uh, I think very this is, patient Kirby. I think again. this is a poor matchup in uh, Ryan's favor just because Kirby has the speed. Uh, Kirby's not a fast character, but compared to DDD. He is Mach 3. And he's Speed Racer. Oh, man. He, yeah, but he's been hit twice. And he, four times he's at 50%. That's insanity. I mean, he's getting a little bit too antsy. Like, he shouldn't be staying that close. He should be waiting till he does dumb things. Um, knocking back Gordos and stuff like that is what he I needs to I think he could have gotten another up air out of that, but whatever. Uh, he just we ain't to optimized, sick. boys. That Gordo does a lot of damage. Damn. Um, I think that it... Oh, rolls right into it. Honestly, I think that the Gordo needs to do damage just because, like, it's no, one of, of DDD's o only options. No, of course it needs to do damage. I'm just yeah. saying it did a lot of damage. All right. Good for just this the spacing with the the, the the forward tilt is so good. DDD, why? Put the hammer away. Let's just hug it out. He should have held that a little bit longer. Um, oh, got a little bit a little oh, bit too greedy with that. I don't know if you could see that the 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 change the, the background change was in full white. Yeah, I just don't think that's ever a safe option though to go. What, the upbeat. And candy eyes. Okay, so this is a clown fiesta. Okay, up tilt into up tilt into up air. Very nice. Got a good 21%. Strong. I think that uh, just keeps doing it. Honestly, I think that uh, DDD should use his inhale from time to time, um, and just get Kirby off stage. Because well, I mean, I mean, sure, but I will trust Rock and Ryan's judgment on this. He's been playing the character far more than we do. Yeah, I was just saying, like, I think that, uh, I think it's a good option because Kirby has one of the most predictable recoveries. That is um, true. Yeah, no, actually, you're right. You are correct. That is true. I didn't, I didn't even consider that. Yeah, because like, it, you know oh, what a Kirby's going to do. He's either going to go up towards the stage and just float above it, or he's going to go under and wait to try to sweet spot the upbeat because anything else would be dumb. Yeah. And only useful as a mix-up. Oh, up smash does not quite kill. DDD's very, heavy very boys. heavy uh, for a balloon. The heaviest of the balloon characters, some might say. Are you calling Meta Knight a balloon? I'm not calling Meta Knight a balloon. He does not inflate, therefore he's not a balloon. <laughs> oh, falls right into it. These Gordos for spacing. Just Oh, that was ballsy. He just dashes up and then doesn't do anything. Like, it's he doesn't even shield. It's and that's going to kill him. I think he's trying to foxtrot into, like, an up smash or something like that. And I he's guess. stuck in that. But that, that. That's so close. Like, he's so close. You're still getting hit. Even with Kirby's foxtrot, oh, yeah. you're still getting hit with a forward tail. I don't think that's safe. Yeah, absolutely. Like, Unfortunately. Um, I just think what it comes down to, if you're playing, um, if you're playing as uh, Kirby, what it comes down to is playing super patiently and optimizing every punish. If you don't optimize a punish, the opponent will punish your lack of optimization. That's and that's And that's kind of how Kirby's supposed to work, I think, honestly. Um, I'm not entirely sure if this is a good stage for Kirby, just because... Uh, it, well, it's flavorful. Yeah. So I mean, it's already a flavor win. Yes, but... Uh, so I see, like, the platforms being an issue for Kirby, because DDD can stand under them, use Gordos on the top, and then just... As, as you saw there, I mean, yeah. he didn't... That wasn't the most effective way for me to explain Uptilt. that, but uh, no, 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 I got you. But he can he can turtle underneath the platforms and then just use uh, Gordos. Re into regrab. Okay, we've got a game. Now, now we actually have play stop. Um, oh. Remember, DDD he's got has a, he's three got a, different he's got angles. Shield those those Gordos. Um, honestly, like, uh, and there we go. He's listening. He is right there, so he might be able to hear me. Oh, that was sick. Doesn't kill, but that was still sick. Um, he uh, needs to be careful about clanking because uh, DDD wins all clashes. <laughs> uh, DDD Even with Gandorf? 
I mean, okay, uh, I'll keep it to this matchup. Yeah. Forward smash. Ken does not fall for the uh, the forward smash trick of come into my forward smash. Ooh, that was like the perfect spot. That was very well played by Ken. He found the exact spot he needed to be in. Or uh, Ryan. Yeah. I was talking about the Gordo. How if Ken had not gra grabbed Edge a frame too soon, it would have been it. Because that Gordo will kill at this kind of person. Oh yeah, no, of course. I think that he could go for a funny mix-up, going for the up B into the, the stomp, just because he Ooh. never does it. That seals off stock one. Um, 114 is a little bit low for Kirby to kill. So uh, right now we just need that extra credit, right? Yeah, R Ryan's just racking up damage now. That's all he's got to do. He's got a, he's got a free stock up. Oh. Um, Down tilt just pushes him right off. He has off. five jumps, so he's got time. Yeah. I, Kills oh. off the top. I think that's why he brought him here. He's gonna, he knows he's going to have to kill off the top. Yeah. Um, <coughs> and uh, Dreamland, one of the favorites for characters that kill off the top. I would know. I play Fox. Well, I mean, it can be. Uh, I think Kirby just benefits very greatly. A solid, a solid throw combo. Um, Kirby was patient, waited it out. Um, oh, he runs right for into glory it. traps. For glory traps. We online now, boys. Boys. All right. These these are some very well spaced forward airs. Goes in for one or two hits, and then does, with a third one just gets r out, right the heck out of dodge. Oh, yeah, but uh, unfortunately, DDD's hammer is longer than uh, Kirby's feet. Yeah. Jab, jab. Oh, that could have sealed it that, off. That, could, that was really ballsy to fall in there, but, you know, who's going to do that? Well, Kirby's going to do it, apparently. That's the follow-up to my own joke. Or thought. Whatever. The hard read. The hardest of reads. And Rock and um, Ryan just goes ahead and goes, I respect your reading. I respect your reading comprehension. <laughs> Here you go. All right. And just um, gives it to him. On, on that side note, I think what uh, Rock and Ryan's going to need to do, like, he, I think he, I'm not sure if he knows this or not, but DDD is tied for the best get up attack and ledge get up attack in the really? game. Really? Yeah. It's because um, just got the longest reach? No, actually, all get-up attacks have 50 frames before your first active frame. Every single one without fail. Um, the only difference between them is the damage that they do. Yep, and the range, I'm assuming. Range. Uh, damage, range, and uh, invincibility frames. Uh, he misses and, the re-grab. That's unfortunate. And uh, DDD has actually the highest amount of invincibility frames tied with Sheik. More damage than Sheik. The only difference is he has a slightly larger hurt box, which okay. is why I would say he's tied for it just because of that. Yeah, so Ken has seemed to uh, adjust to this very well, and now Rock and Ryan is adjusting to his adjustment. Meta so, meta game adjustments. Meta game, you you would know all about those. Meta meta gaming. Yeah, metas. Metas. That's you know they gotta meta do do the meta right thing. Meta right thing. Okay, so apparently his plan right now is to wait at the ledge for five minutes. <laughs> I'm not sure that's going to work, buddy. Um, Forward tilt? So, Into Gordo, as a side note, combo. because nope. I saw that uh, Kirby went for the inhale, um, one of the things that's kind of funny with uh, Kirby is Kirby actually benefits from um, taking DDD's thing. Oh, his power? Yeah. Um, he has a much larger range. Um, That's actually really interesting. Yeah, much larger range, I does more damage. He can't obviously absorb that, and he Ooh. can absorb explosions. So in teams, it's a pretty potent thing, but in this kind of matchup, he can use it to kind of suck DDD up from a larger da you know, distance. Thing. I don't think that's what he wants to be doing, though. No, but you can issue. use it as an effective mix-up since it does 10% damage rather than the, I think it's 6 for a normal one. Back throw? Nope, no, no I think he should have gone for an up throw, honestly, just because that platform was waiting for him. It had his name on it. Yeah, I I agree. I didn't see it. <laughs> um, I oh, think, good neutral air. I think that uh, Ryan could benefit from a uh, hop off the edge to an up air with the hammer like flying through where the edge grabs because uh, Ken has this habit of waiting on the edge. Um, he, oh. I think it's kind of like a wait for something to happen. He keeps rolling. Like he'll ro he just rolls out a shield. I think he needs to change that up. 
uh, Ryan has started to adjust to that. That in particular is killing him. Oh, oh you're up, buddy. All right, back to solo carry. Kick his ass. Oh, booty. This is a family-friendly show. My B. And up throw. Oh, it went right in between. That is very unfortunate. That's some unfortunate timing. But it looks like... Oh, wait. He's got two stocks. Oh, my God. Come on, Ken. Make it a game. That's... There you go. All right. He's got, 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 got a good ways to go to get anything done here, but... Oh, these re-grabs are so good. They're the veritable sick nasty. Grabs the ledge into drop forward air. Oh. Ooh, we are getting some Street Fighter on stream. Up throw? Not quite, not quite. Almost there. Ken's really bringing this back. He's got decent ways to go. Oh. Is that going to do it? Don't think he DI'd that. Alright. <laughs> Balloon match. Alright. They're just... They're staring at each other. Uh... Ryan creeping forward a little bit. We got a tied game. Oh, he just pops out a little bit too far. Can't quite catch him with the up tilt out of that. All right. A lot of shield stops. See the down tilt. DDD wanting you to uh, draw him like one of your French girls. Okay, I see what Ken's going for. He's going for this grab into up air. Can't grab into up air. Grab him to up throw on the platform. And is this going to do it? That, no, nowhere near. Okay. Oh, he waited just a second too long to throw out that up smash. Ryan just follows the roll. Just back airs. All right. Ken gets there. 